Welcome back to the Angry American. Listen, Angry Americans, we're going to get right to the video evidence. This lady overheard four FEMA execs at the airport and listen to what's really going on. This is first-hand knowledge. They didn't know she could hear them. These are facts. This is truth. This is what's really going on with FEMA and our hurricane relief from Hurricane Helene that all these people need and why they're not getting it. Picked up a flight of uh, pediatric medical supplies that were brought in um, and are going to North Asheville. We were sitting in the private portion of the airport and we got to overhear an awful lot. The Army pilots, the Navy pilots, hospital representatives, um, there was a lot of chatter. While we were there, a private jet landed and four FEMA representatives got off. Four. Four people off of a private jet. Come to find out, and you're not going to hear this, so let me tell you. Come to find out, Mission Hospital was told, a private hospital, that they are going to go ahead and be the morgue center for body recovery. All of the Army Chinook helicopters you're seeing flying overhead, they are doing body recovery. FEMA said, and, and you can take this as a direct quote, said that they are too tied up at the border to send any more representatives. Yeah, at the border. So anyhow, I guess border control trumps whatever's going on here. So they told Mission Hospital they are not sending refrigerated trucks so that they can stack the bodies up. And we also overheard that whatever fatality numbers you are hearing, and this is a quote, go ahead and add a couple of zeros. So FEMA's too busy with the border. A private hospital and the army are going to take over body recovery and private individuals with their private helicopters and their private planes are the ones who are flying in supplies. I was at hangar 10. I was picking up supplies. There was a stack for the Cajun Navy. There was a stack that looked like it was ASPCA. These are all being sent by private individuals. FEMA is doing nothing. Go ahead and share that. Wow. I made a video about this earlier and it looks like I nailed it because what I said in the video and I encourage you to go watch it. I'm going to link it to this video. It'll be at the end. But what I said was I went down a list of all the money that we pissed away and how that money is distributed and how uh, FEMA is a department or whatever of Homeland Security. And how they looted all the money from that to give to, you know, umpteen other countries, you know, millions and billions of dollars, billions of dollars. And they're giving the illegals billions of dollars. So they milked all the money out of all of our money, all our taxpayer money, all the American citizens money that's there for them is now gone. So they raided the coffers took all the money and gave it to people who aren't even citizens of the United States. And that's all our tax dollars. That's all American citizens' money. Government does not make money. They don't have a job. They just collect money. And it's your tax money. It's money that you made. They're taxing. Your hard work. They take your money and then they give it away to whoever and wherever they want. And you got to suck it up. America last. That's what the Biden-Harris administration is all about. Mayorkas is right there with them. America last. Americans last. And I guarantee you they're slow walking this relief because a lot of that is Republican area that's been flooded. I think that's probably got something to do with it. And the other part is that they, they did spend all the money. They don't give a shit about Americans. When are you lefties, when are you Democrats, when are you people riding the fence even going to get it? Democrats, 
do not care about anything but power and themselves. They want two classes, elites and scrubs. Anyway, guys, it's going to get a whole lot worse. And it is. Look at this FEMA mess. Before it gets better, we got about a month. Drag everybody you know. Talk to everybody you know. It's your job as an American citizen to do your best to, to get out the vote for Trump and Vance. It's our only hope. It's really our only hope. Anyway, guys, be aware of your surroundings at all times. Because like I keep saying, it's just going to get a whole lot worse before it gets better. Peace, peace, out. <laughs>